Do you remember The End Is Nigh? The game that Edmund McMillan calls his best game he's ever made? There's a mod out called The Future that pays homage to this very game. We're gonna jump in and try it out. It's been a while since I've played End Is Nigh. I am so very confused. I gotta nail it just perfectly. Like this. Yep. <laughs> that was it. There's only a chance that it actually shows up on the cave's floor. So we're gonna have to do multiple runs until we see it. So let's just blast through this, grind it out. Not gonna react to anything. Nope. Yuck. Kinda like you. Make a move. Make a move, sucker. Dude. Oh. Not sure why I picked up that eternal heart. Planning on jumping on the spikes the whole time. Not sure why I didn't reroll the underwear either. School bag D6. Mm. Yuck. There it is, baby. The reason I did not reroll Isaac's tears. Exchange it for something in Angel Devil's secret room, then reroll it. Maybe even two rerolls. How about it, bud? Reverse lover's card, another item. Ooh. First things first. I'll just take that. Damage up for empty red hearts. Reroll time. D6 and eternal D6. They should combine into the mega D6. I'm gonna take red key here now. Red key will help me get more charges on my D. No. Oh. Need those charges, you douche. Pro tip, use your iframes from IV bag to get in and out of the curse room without spending soul hearts. Oh. Ooh. Ah. Oh. We're not gonna get a charge now in our D because those flies. They took it from me. Oh, wow. Could you imagine using Crooked Penny and getting even more items in that room that we can't reroll? Let's go crazy. Double everything in the room, and then Eternal D6 it. Still got my red key. Already going for Guppy. Might as well keep going. Oh, I couldn't, and I shouldn't. This is a mod showcase, y'all. Ultra secret room. First try on this floor. Heartbreak. Three more broken hearts. More damage per heart, though. Yeah, or I could just re-roll it. A mm. little bit about Ultra Secret Room, you guys. It's only connected to the map through red rooms, usually kitty corner away from a normal room on the edge of the map. Ultra Secret Rooms are special rooms that are not connected to any other room on the map directly. They can be accessed directly by opening red rooms adjacent to them using red key or red key wisps, crystal key, cracked key, soul of cane. Ultra Secret Room item pool, they're all red items. Some of those red items are pretty good. Maybe we should have kept rolling, I don't know. Elf, we're going deals with the devil, that's nice. My next magic trick, Getting an I am error room. Once you find the edge of the map, one more room beyond that will automatically take you to I am error room. We'll be locked in there though, so that's what we'll do at the very, very end. Assuming we don't have an entrance to the future. Joker card. No future here. Funny, that's the same thing my dad told me when I told him I was gonna be pursuing YouTube. Notice on the map, when I opened this room, it did not show me the red unfinished room on the map. So we know it's I am error. Joker? I hardly know her. Hmm. Well, I'm not coming back, so we're done here. I am error room. Wow. I am error rooms are just so spicy. Last chance, this floor, to find the future. We're gonna get the future? No. That was such a good run. All right, all right, spicy run, spicy start. Ooh. No, slab. I said no. Oh, can't say no to this. If I take them all, I die. I can only have two. I guess no to the guppy. Oh, it's still open. Yes to the guppy. 
Jumper cables D6. Amazing. Caves one boss. Is it our dude? No. It's a good fight though. <laughs> oh wait, Shade, you are trash. What? Checking this first. Judas' is shadow? That's what I wanted Shade to be. Let's take it and immediately do this. Goodbye, Shade. Gumpy! Ooh! Wow, this run. Oh, no, I would never do that. That'd be stupid. That'd be, nope. Can't agree to that. Stopwatch. Birthright. Book of Belial becomes a passive item similar to Book of Virtues. Grants the Book of Belial if Judas is not currently holding it. Please, please, please give me the future. We're gonna die going to the future with this hell. Planetarium 2. Don't let this be a dead run. Venus. I kind of need the health up right now, oddly. I'll, I'll come back. I'll come back. I got nothing better to use it on. I'm rerolling you. Mercurius. Mercurius. Mercalurculus. No. Uh, more Gubby? Call me crazy. But this is what I'm gonna do. I guess I could have done that post nine lives. Dead cat. Oh, that's right. We're Judas so that we, oh, we don't get a red heart. All right, whatever. And this also won't be a red heart, but I'll use it for charges. So many tears hitting. We're getting so much money. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Smelties? I use that once. Oh man, think of the damage upgrades we could get by using the candle over and over in the same room with my new bookable aisle. The D6 though. Last chance for the boss. No! Did some research, y'all. It turns out that it's not in the boss room that it spawns. There's a 33% chance that it spawns in a dead end on caves or catacombs or mines. Possible that we already had the, the room, but I gave up after the boss room on some of the runs. Yes. I'll take that. Take the other one, too. Look at this upgraded arcade from our birthright. The tech 2? Honestly, might be an okay thing that we did not go there when we were incredibly overpowered. Hotfly? Well, we're on our way to being overpowered right now again. Oh, no. Kane only gets the laser because he only has one eye. No. Just give me homing and I'll feel okay again. Oh, we got our shots back. Ha ha. That's a weird one though. Whoa. The arcade is also here on the flip side. Just gonna harvest it for its resources. Oh, come on. I must have bot fly. I'm gonna use this door to tell me when I've given up too many soul hearts. Oh my God. Ha. Ah. Monstro's lung. Does that work? That's pretty cool. I like firing the laser while I'm charging and then having the blast. This is nice. Massive improvements on what we had. <sighs> there you are. Buddy, I'm not ready yet. I'll come back. Hang on. Found him on Catacombs 2. What a stupid run to have to take to this great new floor. What's what our burrow's gonna look like with this? Cool. That's horrible. All right. The monster's long is pretty powerful. Let's be honest. Angel room, what do you got? What do you get? You get his big old scapular up in there. Reverse stars card. Let's take that to the future. Let's go. Oh, cool. Pirate costume. R. There be loot yonder. Step inside into ye abyss. Damn. Lost it. Okay. You can go. That was probably a Kane specific voice line because I've got the eye patch. Here we go, everybody. <laughs> The future, we made it! I had way more health than I thought I did. Look at these guys. Everything looks all end is nigh-ish. We've seen these enemies before though. These are not new. Just reskinned. Loving the vibe. Color palette change. It's a reference to time fuck on the wall. That's one of Edmund's first games. What is that? Where are you in the corner and what do you do? What's going on here? Okay, these guys shoot and it goes beyond the wall. Got it. Like continuum clotties. Still don't know what these things were doing here. Maybe the things in the middle were actually causing the bullets to go around the edge and it wasn't the enemy. I don't know. You can touch them. Bombing them does nothing. My advanced arcade again. I'm supposed to have really like high chances of these things paying out. Should we just go for it? See what happens. 
full health. That's pretty nice. Yes, feed my gambling addiction. Where are you guys? Okay, a little jumpy brain guys. That's a good amount of uh, added difficulty. I should wait for some of these guys to even attack to see what they do. This guy's got, uh, it's basically like a guardian angel little baby, but it's got little pop shots. Oh, okay, and then it does that. Where are you? You are adorable. Turret, bro. What about these guys? They just kind of look like they act like spikes, but this guy turned white. Teleports and changes locations with a spike block. That's cool. That's cool. Those guys just died. Okay. I'm going too hard here. Bee lickers, but they have ghost forms that explode. Sweet. Another full heal. Let's go back to the arcade. I'm trying to think maybe I should switch over to the demon beggar the nail blood bag i was looking for one of those another one. Oh, man, i don't even see the kidney stone over here can i have it i blew up the poops already son of a gun where are you guys the little turret dudes what do you want you want my more options well what will you give me back the fame heck yes good deal this guy just ate that dude! Now what? You good, dude? Hello? Guy? Ow. What the? Is that your butt? Sir, is this your butt? Can't touch that either. That's it, huh? You got anything else? That's all you do? If I gave you this. Alright. Well, okay. The fame made that impossible to tell what happened. No, I'm Kane. You see my trinket, sir? I'm sorry, I can't. You can have this, though. What do you want? Damage upgrade? How about you, sir? Health up? You can have that. Oh, more charge on my charge? Wait a second, why is it charging even slower? I want my damage upgrade, but I want to see what you're going to give me. Oh, God. We're circling the drain. Look at this guy. This little fish buddy with- oh, it's dead now. You want more things from me? It just seems like a floor where you re-roll stuff. Take it. The hell is I gonna do? Oh no, I have Ludo with Dunn's cap, y'all. It's- it's over, man. I don't know what to say. What the? How did I get hurt? What is this? Portals! That's pretty cool. Wait a minute, there's no shop on this floor? Or secret room? Oh, there was a secret room the whole time. What? 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 Hello? Golden Judas Tongue. Hey, you're gonna sell me back the stuff I sold? Oh, God, in the corner! Wow, okay. Um, yeah, do you have sa uh, flight? Do you have flight for sale? I'm gonna reverse Star's card here. Gets rid of my guppy's tail anyways. Flippin' rip. Epic fetus. What is that gonna do with Ludo? Probably cancel the whole show. Cancels the whole show. Oh, I still have Dunn's cap, you guys. I'm bombing the shopkeeper. I'm sorry. Are you mad? It's got plus devil chance for that? I hate everything about this. Oh, things are getting more expensive! Guy wasn't... No, I didn't see that. And now he's gone. Well, that was, like, really cool for, like, five seconds. Look at the walls. Look at the walls. This is a take on the final floor, I think, of End is Nigh. That's why you see, like, these guys are tracking me. Boss is nevermore. What do you do? What is going on? I'm too afraid to bomb them. I want to see all this stuff. Like, you have different orbitals that do different things. I don't know what the white one's supposed to be doing here. Oh, there it is. And there you go. Some stuff for you. Oh, we've got brand new ones. Brand new ones. And the walls are encroaching. I get close to the walls that come after me. That is pretty much how it works in the Vidja game. Okay, that's cross eye guy. Is that it? Are you done? Gave me iron cart. Here I am saying there's no new items. Health up, heals one red heart, black heart damage up. Sweet, dude. Is that it? You go back to normal now? Back to normal. On Dank Depths 2. Now he's got to beat the game with this dumb combo. Oh, speaking of dumb, razor blade. Pretty cool floor. I really like those enemies. That'd be pretty neato if there was a secret floor like that in the real game. Thematically, I don't think it makes much sense. Still pretty awesome, nonetheless. I think it's pretty difficult to come up with characters, enemies that aren't inherently overpowered or underpowered, that balances sacred, and then to make it fit into the other characters 
and enemies in the game. Pretty impressive. Planetarium. That could be fun. Soul. Yeah. All right. Hate everything else about this run. Please make it end. Angel room. Spirit soul. Bam, 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 bam. Guess who doesn't have to deal with all the rest of the BS? Yes. This guy in the clear. <laughs> Laz rags. Spirit sword lacks a lot of synergy, so probably still gonna speed run. That wraps up the episode, everybody. All that for one floor. Great mod though, and the fact that you're not guaranteed to see it means that you can actually slip it in with your normal mods and it won't change up your gameplay every single time. It won't be that repetitive. Let me know your thoughts on this mod in the comment section down below. Let me know if you wanna see more of this. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.